Hello, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome back to Outward. And our uh, first episode of our Let's Play of Outward. Yes, we actually crashed on the way back home from a very profitable trip. Unfortunately, many of Cicero's citizens did not make it. Yeah, we weren't... We actually, our grandmother, uh, we had acquired a blood debt from long ago. We were still paying off. We're gone four months, owed 150 silver. The townspeople almost went into our heads. They still do, but there's a... The leader of this, the elder of the city, gave us five days to get 150 silver. Or a writ of favor from one of the inhabitants, which I do believe we actually managed to find quite easily last night on the shore. Explored a little bit of the cave and a storage room as well. We also have a job to find that mushroom, which I think we might have seen in that cave. But I was kind of too busy running away at the time. But ladies and gentlemen, yeah, we are back in Outward. Very lovely game so far. I did do a little bit of inventory sorting. A little bit of food crafting as well. I made some Gabberry Tartine. A little bit of grape jam on bread. Quite a bit of food restoration on that one. And I did, I wanted to keep the mining pick in case we go to that mine again and see what we can get. And the hatchet just in case. Maybe we need that for wood or some crafting. We'll have to see. So I did actually leave out quite a bit off the inventory. So, well, that's still in the satchel. We're a little heavy, but I think we'll be all right. So we're going to have to set up to the top of the hill over there and see if we can talk. We well, might as well grab some more if I can make some more... Uh, jam or uh, tartine there. But they did have a little combat with the troll as well. Yeah, that was a little close. Luckily nothing bad happened to us. I don't think they mind if we pick some berries. They don't seem to be using those. So we got something over here as well. Ooh, a felling great axe, really. Wow, okay, well. That's actually not. Speed's not too bad. They are not amused. Alright. So let's head inside, see if we can uh, pay off this debt. Town Hall. Great level. I feel like I should have equipped that. Just feels very imposing coming to town like that. All right, Razor Aberdeen. Greetings. How go your efforts? I want to talk about my blood price. You have a way to make that payment. Sure. I, I did actually earn a tribal favor. We saved a young man last night. Um, Are you proven to be next last into the tribe when you put your mind to it? So we're not going to lose our home. Well done, Cierzo thanks you for your great deed. That was actually a lot easier than I was expecting. Oliel and Izan are leaving Cierzo. What do you mean they're leaving? What's going on? Oliel is leaving to go join the holy mission of Elat. Well, damn! I will miss her around here. As will we all. So she's your daughter. And yes, when I see you leaving, he can't be ready for another ex expedition already. A blood price has been declared upon his bloodline. Oh. <sighs> Roland fell asleep on duty. Oh, wow, that's... I was wondering why about the lighthouse would happen. This is unacceptable. Yeah, that isn't fair. I understand punishing Roland, but why Zan? The blood price must be levied against an entire bloodline. Okay, so anyway, they must be related. The blood price is not a punishment. Without violence. Without it, we would be ruled by vengeance, revenge, and mob rule. Come back once you've said your goodbyes to them. Okay, I. 
I fought a troll and I picked some berries outside. I'm not quite sure I'm ready to handle the world outside, but we'll, we'll see. Alright, so we should go talk to them. Also, check out, we'll check out a little bit of the crafting and check around here. Get a little sleep buff as well. Nice. A shield wouldn't be horrible, but... Travel rations. We we actually have some for travel rations. We just need salt. Which I guess if we want to leave a region, we're going to need that. Alright, fair enough. I'm not saying I'm going to go around stealing anything, but... I could be tempted. Nothing in bookshelves. Oh, is this stealing, though? I don't know if it's stealing, so I'm just going to assume this is an accident. Yeah, that's just... I found that as far as I know. So boot-wise, it's actually less. Hot weather. It's more for hot weather. I don't know if we should keep that in case we go somewhere hot. Yeah, I have to have to get for free gear for... Wow, that is... Quite amazing, actually. So I do believe there was a basement. Don't mind me, madam. I'm just... Looting your house. What is this a... Town key is required. Alright. Fair enough. I'm just kind of curious if we can sell any of this uh, loot we kind of have. I'm not sure we explored every vendor in town as well. And Liddy up ahead actually did have a quest for us to find a mushroom, which I think we might have saw in that cave. I'm not 100% sure, though. Because it does bear more investigating. Which is not making great speed. Alright, can I trade some stuff to you? Greetings, friend. That's better. I don't know how many weapons we have right now, so might as well just try to keep as much as we can. It grants modern resistance. That could come in handy. So you don't know yet yet is valuable, so it's probably best we don't actually. That's fair. Let's I see uh isn't so we should go talk to him. And also, what do we have here? We've got, ooh, and we got the machete. Can I cannot go swimming? I want to just put that down for now. I want to go with you. I've got one little fishing barge to my name, and by a lap, I'm going to use it. I'm leaving for the heroic kingdom of Levant, never to darken the stain of a city again. The heroic kingdom believes in chasing progress to create a better world. Listen. Don't have an answer to it. Plus, travel laws and the misdeeds of your ancestors. Why so far away? Levant believes that everyone deserves a shot at what they're best at. Told of her brother that Tyrant Risa the better. It is in the middle of a desert. I guess we would know that. We'll go by ocean as far as we can, then lake it across the Abrasar Desert on foot. Well, I'm not ready to kind of 
We can always find you, I suppose, one day. I'm going to miss you, Zan. Win be at your back. Likewise, my friend. If you plan to make the journey to Levant completely on foot, be prepared for a long, long journey. Okay, Tristan, by going southeast, then travel east through the entire Earthmark Forest, and finally south through the desert itself. If you have the courage to face the Abrasar Desert, I almost feel like I should have gone with him at that point. But I don't think we're quite ready for that yet. And I guess we can, I did see on the loading screen when I was coming in, we can actually boil this water if we need to, so. Alright, we have plenty in our water skin. We'll see if she's up here. Then we have to definitely drop some more weight. Not too bad of an adventure, really, though. She's actually really recognizable with that sword. Where are they? I guess this is goodbye. I'm no looking back. To join the holy mission. Did something happen? You're scowling. I don't know if that's a scowl, but. Mother and I had a talk. Don't like any of what I heard. Risa has done some things I can't agree with. We can't of... talk about it. Okay, can't talk about it. I have no desire to be chamber lady. All right, listen. Um, I will think about it because you do have a glowing sword, and that would probably keep me alive. is about more than just working under a manifested god. Help anyone regardless of tribe or family. Have discipline and mastery over yourself. Better others improve and help one another. Hmm. If you do want to join us, meet me in Monsoon in the Hallowed Marsh. He's east of the Charentine. Okay, so he's, he's on southeast. She's east. Okay, so she's left. But we can't travel with them. Blessings of Allah upon you. Oh, Rufus, I'll leave you be. See, yes, wait, definitely thing. They do have a mid range backpack here for sale, but I, we don't have any money. I think what we'll do is drop this stuff really quickly. Maybe just have two weapons. A backup weapon just in case, but... Definitely might go by a little bit less weight. So far, graphically not the greatest game, but I don't think every game has to be. The music is good. The world so far is great. I am just enjoying my time in it. And we'll stash a couple things. Check our stats really quick, and then we'll go talk. Back to the chamber lady. And then I like to go explore that storage area again. Uh, we do have a pickaxe. Maybe I can do some mining. Yeah, we are going to need some money. I'd like to get some better gear before we'd go out venturing further in the city. Okay, we don't think we're going to need the big hatchet. We do have a skill with that. Uh, damage 18, damage 16. I'm actually going to leave the Great Axe for now. And Shiv. Uh, we don't really have any dagger skills. We'll leave that for now. And these boots. We're going to need one lantern at least. I'm going to store this for now. Poison for a weapon. I don't think we're going to need that for the moment. So yeah, okay, we're quite a bit lighter now. But 
Actually, let's go get... Give me... Uh, I think I need three to make that. All right. Quite a bit lighter. Let's go out. Also, check our stats really quickly. Could use something to drink, and we'll probably fill up our water skin before we leave town again. Get a good drink. Ah, that's the spot. A little bit of rain as well. So let's go talk to the chamber lady. If she has nothing really for us, we'll head over to the cave. It's about making our, uh, getting our first quest done. Because I could actually, we could afford a more decent backpack. What is going on here? There you are. Urgent news just came in. Uh, what happened? This is troubling. There's trouble in Berg. Must be a nearby city. Official council meeting has been called. I'm going to Berg, the main settlement in the Enmakar forest. Okay, home city of all the tribes. So really we have quest lines in three places kind of pulling us now. If you're able, I can meet me there. I have an offer. I will pay off the rest of your blood price and adopt you into the Aberdeen bloodline. Okay, so still have ice. my blood price, I was kind of wondering how much that was. It's still worth thousands of silvers. Where's this coming from? It's complicated. Okay, so she needs an heir. It's about coming together as a family. Well then. So everyone has what they need to survive. It's your choice. Your life is in your hands. Alright, so we actually have quite a bit of choice now. You will need to prepare travel rations. Okay, so we're gonna need some salt. Oh. Listen. Well, she should give us some, so that's kind of incentive to head down to her. Southeast as well, so both the Zahn and her go the same way. Alright, so she's taken off. If there's something troubling in the nearby city, they call it a meeting like that. I don't think that's something that normally happens. Now, is that the ship that we crashed? I don't think that's the ship we crashed in. Could be, I think it would have... Well, this, the city was nearby. Okay, but alright. So we're kind of on our own here, ladies and gentlemen. Now we can, uh... We have a choice of three paths to take. Or even we can really take none at all, I suppose. Okay, so let's go investigate this. And there's a cache by the boat as well. Do you to the south? And don't pick up everything you find. You know who you're talking to, right? That could be a bit of a problem. Okay, he's dead, right? I'm gonna assume he's dead. I really hope he is dead. Yep, he's dead. Okay. That's kind of interesting. What is this gate for? It's another mystery. Okay, my problem is here is we don't have... Yeah, I can do a light, but I can't do a weapon at the same time. So, could I actually... We did find that here. No, I cannot see anything, so. We'll investigate a while. I see you.
Actually, I do believe they have horrible eyesight, but they can't. They do hear very well. Oh. Okay, I gotta get my weapon here. Yeah. So I think we got him a little bit. I'm gonna head back towards his fire so I can actually see. Apologize for this. Run a little bit. Okay, we can see. Come on. Oh, got us a little bit. He overstepped. And he's down. Okay. Try and let's not work about that right now. Okay, so we did get a common mushroom. Okay. See, I would imagine that was a mushroom, but maybe not quite what we were looking for. So we got an iron vein. Okay, so we did get a little bit of scrap. And some thick oil. So maybe we'll make some fire arrows, maybe? We'll have to see. Let's keep exploring further. And also check on the lantern as well, because I'm not sure how long this puppy lasts. Okay, we can actually get better lanterns as well, it looks like. Is this? Come more common mushroom. All right, fair enough. Let's double back a little bit. Okay, that's as far. All right. Also, remember, I have to use our special ability as well. All right, so we've covered everything to here. All right. I see something. Looks like a sign. Probably you are hosed. Interesting. Danger, going forward, we'll strand you in the wilderness until you make your way back to the village. Um. Well, alright then. Thank you for the warning. I feel like they should let you fall like that, but I understand. So really there is... They're kind of looking like the mushrooms that they were talking about, but it doesn't look like we can harvest. Must be in another cave. Fair, but we've cleaned this out. Do I have enough inventory space for that? I do. We could at least sell that at the very least. Yeah, I wouldn't be opposed to it. We pick up some mushrooms. Got a little bit of iron scrap. Not a ton, though. And we cleared out these caves. I think I'm going the right way. Yeah. Okay, there we go. I suppose we could pull the torch out, though. Very nice. Now let us head back. And let's see what that spear would be worth. Maybe we can talk to the uh, blacksmith. I know we can break it down for stuff, but... It's kind of your light when you're sneaking. And to see another lovely day. Now, Mark, I kind of feel like, one thing is like, you're not the hero, you're not the chosen one. I kind of feel like we are right now. 
but it isn't too bad. Um, where was? Yeah. See me if you buy that for me. What can I do for you? All right. Okay, that would fetch me. What would I get if I broke that down, though? I actually have no idea how to break that down right now at the moment, so... I guess we're gonna sell it. What could I do for you? All right. Six isn't a horrible price, I imagine. We need to get three travel rations. Looks like they got pretty good durability though, so that's not gonna go out right away. Alright, so now we're up to 33 silver. Oh yes, we're doing quite good. 33 silver. We're gonna be fine. Let me the alchemist. I don't believe we actually talked to you last time. Hey there. Can you teach me about magic? Yeah, we didn't match and talk about magic earlier. What's got your curiosity? What is mana and how do you control it? Mana is energy that flows through everything. Plants, animals, people, even rocks. Mages are those who've learned how to capture that energy in magic spells. Magic is something that requires patience to master. Okay, combining spells in right sequence. Can you teach me? Where can I learn magic? Of mana, you must travel to a ley line, a place where Ori's life flows strong. Large Purple Mountain. The Holy Mission and the Kingdom of Levant have their own paths into the Conflux Mountain as well. Okay, so those two side ones do have their own path. Let's see what you have. Chakram. Ooh, some really, really nice stuff. But alas, we are a poor peasant. The sun is starting to go down a little bit as well. The day has passed quickly. I think we should head home. Take stock really quick and then I... Guess we'll head out. Days could go by pretty quick. Definitely not hurting for supplies at the moment. Let's head back home and check out stash real quick. It's enough for a campfire. Do we actually, can we craft some bandages? Quarter staff, not a horrible idea, but. Okay, so we wait on that then. We could use a little bit of healing as well. Yeah, we can get a little bit of sleep. Sadly, we're not allowed to head up to the light tower, uh, the lighthouse tower, so I say boo on that. Boo on that, indeed. I would love to set out in the morning, though. Uh, we haven't got to see the outside world, really, unless it was at night. Just in case. But then, yeah, I'll just sleep till morning. Been a little bit repairing, and do the rest. Yeah, just resting, making sure we're well refreshed before we travel out. Okay, so let's see about... Weirdly enough, our food, drink, and everything's at a hunt. How does that work when we're asleep? All right, not going to question it. Maybe just had a meal. All right, ladies and gentlemen, let's head off. 
The day is dawning. Now there was a cave out by the shoreline and it didn't look tempting though they had one of those creatures. I'm not sure if we could take it. I have we have no idea on levels how strong that is. I'm going to grab those berries while we're on their way there. Now this is a kind of a scouting mission expedition. I don't plan to leave the region just yet. I don't feel like we've really even got our uh, feet wet as it were. Yeah, this will be kind of a bit of a slower let's play. We'd have a quest for her as well. See if we can actually pull that up. If blue sand is brought to him, held fungus. Blister Burrows, northeast of Cicero. Okay, northeast. What was that about a sacrifice, though? <laughs> Only vaguely. A permanent sacrifice of health and stamina. Ooh, so there's quite a bit of trade off. If we did get magic, but how much is the sacrifice? I kind of feel like magic's pretty awesome. It would probably be worth it. All right, so let's head out. Interestingies, the vast open world. We're gonna try to avoid combat if we can. We're certainly in no shape for it just yet. I feel like those uh, troglodytes were pretty easy. Okay, I guess I'll grab some more. If we get some more, we can make some more bread. Can I possibly... I was wondering if we could get a map. Maybe we have to find one. Oh, we actually do have some cosmetic... Okay, we got a pet pearl bird. All right. A bit of sorting there as well. Still no map, which is just fine with me. Oh, I do want to go exploring this way. Plunge will grab more berries. If I can make that tartine kind of jam sandwich there, I am all for it. Yeah, let's go a little bit of berry collecting. Along the shoreline, because there is that stash by the ship. I would love to grab. Okay, that's the bird. I was legitimately freaked out. Also, I'm gonna just we don't have that craziness from before. Okay, even then it's like protects against the cold. So we did manage to get a bug as well, it seems. Rather slow weapon, I but we do have a skill for it. So we'll take it for now. Do we want to head? There was that cave, which I think is actually that away. I'm kind of interested in the shoreline, see what we can find. Guess we'll grab more berries. Oh no, because we had to go farther out, that's why. Yeah, there's that cave over yonder. I don't know if we can take one of these guys. I feel like I would really like a proper sword and shield. We can make a crappy shield, but... I don't know if I feel if I'd be okay with that. 
Alright, sun's probably about midday at this point. And that must be the mountain they were talking about. Oh! Okay, whoa, 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 whoa. Oh, God, they're not joking. They're not joking. Got you. Oh, God. We'll kill one and we can deal, deal with the other one. Oh, God. Ah. We need a bandage. Currently, we're... Alright. Finish him off quick. God, ah. Uh, get up. No, we're dead. Oh, no. God, we are dead already. Now, this will bring us into a very interesting mechanic. You raise your arms, shielding your vulnerable foot from the animals that howl at you and brace yourself for death. Fangs sink into your leg and you feel yourself dragged across the ground. You finally come to open your eyes, you see a half eaten leg of some poor explorer inches from your face. Hyenas howl nearby, hungry for flesh. Clearly, dinner has been served. Oh, that's very bad. Okay, we did get a fishing harpoon. Oh, they didn't kill my poor bird, did they? Okay, so we are alive. Let's check our stats. We don't have any... Ooh. So we have an infection. Is that permanent? Fishing our poom boots are... I guess I'll take it. That could be important. No, 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 no. Bye, later. Yeah, let's not get murdered again. I have no idea where we are. Might not be able to find our way back home. Oh, wait. Also, turn off the... Never mind, run. I don't know if we're going to be able to outrun him. I can buy some time to get my... There we go. One-on-one, -on -one, I think we could take him. Though... Okay, are we still... I need to bandage. Okay, so that actually is healing. He apparently ran away. I was just that scary. Okay, these are the Hynia fields. Oh god. I will come back and murder you all someday. Let's just be very stealthy. There's a few hyenas just... Over yonder. Can we... Oh, we must be very far from home. I'm kind of amazed they dragged us this far, to be honest. Yeah, so you see, death is not the end in Outward. There's actually many different events things can happen to you. Are we still... So can I actually craft another bandage? Apparently that was not enough. Okay, so we're still bleeding, I believe. I think we're okay for now. Get a bird over there. 
Well, there's a road. Also, some eggs. Why do I have a feeling I'm going to get murdered? Pearl bird nest. Alright, we'll grab some eggs. Then we can go home and make an omelette. If we can get at least a better view of where we are. I think this is... Okay, yeah, alright. I think I know where we are now. Maybe. Isn't this just where we... I wonder if their bodies are still here. No, this is not where I was thinking that we are. We are quite lost. Okay, so no, actually, we're not too far off at the cave. I mean, we go down here anyway. Hello, trunk. Ooh, actually, we got a straw hat. Hot weather defense. Endurance potion. Bolt rag. And fang. Get a fang great club. Ooh. And us. We have a hat now. This is the best day ever. Cue the epic music. We learned how to do that. I kind of want to go check out. Yeah, I see if those bodies are still there. And we got to figure out how to get rid of a disease as well. Yeah, that infection could be definitely bad for us. So this was a hard lesson today about not getting murdered in combat because that was actually pretty bad. I know we got at least one of them though. So I'm going to think it's this way. Up oh, here he is. So we got some raw meat and hide. Was there another one nearby, or did he? He must have got us and drug. He's the one that drug us back. Okay, so town is back this way. We need another bandage, which we. I'm not sure how much bandages are gonna take. Other than two linen cloth, I guess we could buy some, but we really don't have the money for that. Yeah, this is a bit of a costly mistake. So Leyline Mountain is over that way. Just don't think we can leave yet having this disease over our heads. Right, so let's head back into town. For now, looking definitely more like a traveler. Surely they have some kind of potion, and we have to get a bandage as well. Yeah, I feel like our character actually, yeah, is making progression. We're never going to be the chosen one, the Dova King. Should keep an eye on, see if those actually respawn or not. The berries. Are those a different kind of berries, or are they the same? Crab eye. Okay, if we got some seeds as well. Interesting. See that when grilled is the first step in creating usable poisons. Ooh. I never really did notice that statue there before. Can I help you? I'm um, alright. Thank you. Can we talk to the priest first? Maybe he could. Can you, can you hear me? Blessings of a lot upon you. What do I do if I catch a disease? Types of tea to begin your recovery process.
Okay, so eventually we'd have to lie, lay down for quite a while. Several days before I'm well again. Okay, so let's see. I, need another, I don't have bandages. Is there something you need? Okay, you just have general kind of gear. Oh, he does have tea. Ingestion. Common cold. Infection. Okay, for eight silver. And one bandage. For three, it's going to cost us eleven. Do you have any salt by the chance? Oh, you do have some salt. It's going to cost us seventeen. I feel like that's fair. I was going to actually learn how to craft quite a bit of this itself. A little bit. Ooh. That might be worth it if we get some uh, more money. Alright. A little overweight. We're going to head back home. For next episode, I might do a little just kind of scrounging, scavenging. A little bit of busy work before we head out again. Get a little bit more used to the world. I definitely feel we are making forward progress. Not quite sure. Also, what do you think? Uh, where should we go? There seems to be three main branches. I'm not... I do want to investigate the ley line. I feel like magic is something we're going to need. Something we're going to want. Also, I do love having a bird. Okay, so it's actually... We're going to drink that. Okay, this gives some cold protection as well. And a bandage. Alright, for now. So we're healing up. Rather slow, but we are healing. Let's make some more jam. We can make another travel ration. Ah, I'd rather. Not quite, we need some daily stuff too. Let's do our stash real quick. Toss the old lantern in there. Here's a chance of disease when eaten raw. Okay, so that provides healing and stamina over time. I'm just going to stash that for now. Can make poisons with that. If we stash these, they won't deteriorate as fast. We, we can hope. Yeah, pick up some food for next time. Let's get our hands on a bow as well. This isn't that too bad. I'm kind of curious anyway to see... Let's just do that and make sure we can heal all the way here. So it does look like we yeah, we are cured. And weirdly when you do rest in your house, all the meters go back to not having you use any supplies. So something definitely when you lose early game. Probably a jump. I think we will leave off here. Yeah, an eventful day. Definitely a eventful day. I feel like well at the very least we did learn something. Never go into a hyena cave. Jesus, they're vicious. Alright, I hope you guys enjoyed. Be sure to hit that like button, it's up a lot. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you guys next time.